today we action done yet start should we just we're good stop to go each other here hello so what kind hello, of gun is it hello hello okay go <gasps> okay seems like we're good and I'm waiting is he gonna interrupt again now he's going to <laughs> this is the Sears Ranger 101.16 it's actually a Savage 6A Springfield 87 that was manufactured for Sears back in the 40s 50s 60s range it's actually a real interesting old gun here you can pull this lever out and it's semi-automatic or push it in and get straight bolt action so that's fairly unique but this was just sitting in my spawn calling out to me so here she is Interesting to note is that so long as the trigger's held back, the bolt will stay open. Bolt's a little hard to operate and everything, but I think getting cleaned up, that should go away. Overall, a very nice gun. Needs a little bit of work, but it's actually pretty accurate. It holds about 16, maybe 17, depending on how you load it. It actually holds more if you keep the bolt open, just because it, the round fits down there close to the, where the lifter is. You want to point out the stock damage? At, at some point it was dropped or something, and there's this nice crack going all the way down, around, and up again. It's been repaired with some glue and some screws here, here, and here. That'd be a simple fix. Take these old screws out and drill a hole right around where this one is, straight through. Put in a dowel of some sort. Maybe do something similar on this side. Sand it out, even it up, and give it a refinish. And Probably won't even be able to tell the dowels were there. This does take long and shorts, but the shorts are bolt action only, as are the longs. Only the long rifles have enough power to throw this bolt back to go semi-auto.
Mertwe. Definitely conserves ammo. What, Barbie? Don't think they meant to do that. It seems to... The wood rubbing seems to get your hand pretty good going for the bolt. Ah, no, it's that screw and split. If it was just smooth, it would be okay, but I'm running over that split and screw there. That makes sense. Definitely gonna have to fix that. Action. Safety works. It's always important. I'd say it's just as fast as any other semi-auto. Something tells me with the way that mechanism works, it would be extremely easy to violate certain federal laws with that particular 22 rifle. But we'd never do that. Uh, absolutely not. We, we'd never even attempt to do that. But uh, the way the mechanism works, if if you simply eliminated the hold back on that bolt, yeah, it would take off and run. But uh, you can see what those vents are for here on my hand. Just got some of that dirt and debris that normally comes, unburnt powder. Blows it out the side. Uh-huh. And since my hand was being held just right, it just fell on and like peppers on my hand. I don't think you did too bad for a sub $100 rifle. Yeah. I think you could do much better for sub 100. Clean it up a little bit and polish the bolt. Put a scope on it. <laughs> yep, it's got the scope mounts. Not bad. A lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe.